Hey guys, it's Smite here, and today we're going to be doing the Magic Origins Fat Pack opening. Let's get right into it. Alright guys, let's get right into it. Um, so, I'm really pumped, because I've been waiting for this forever. It took a long while, because I'm, well, I'm just surprised by that as it is. So, let's just get, get right into it, because this is, this is, this might be my favorite set so far, I mean... It's been, I don't think I've done a magic uh, opening ever. Um, so, let's get into it. So, apparently, there's different types of fat packs. Well, hold on. First off, disclaimer. If you see the pack of my deck right here, desk right here, it is full of cards. I am terribly sorry if that is like, oh my gosh, she's so dirty. What are you doing? Um... I just have been working on different... Oh, golly. What the heck? Different decks for Magic and other kind of things. Uh, and I'm so sorry we have not been putting out videos. There's just so many ideas. But, true story. Not a lie. I got a virus on my computer. Wah, wah, wah. Um, so... Ugh, here we go. So, I was not able to... I need to totally re-download my recording system... But I'm planning to f find a different one that's a lot better. And then, with that one that I downloaded, this other one, I totally downloaded an another virus. So, luckily, it's they're all okay now. No worries, no fears. Looks like, make sure we don't steal it, today. Eh? Anyways. Oh, gosh. Okay. Literally, one of my favorite far p parts about a fat pack, the player's guide. Not even kidding. Look at this thing. It tells you all about the cars. Every single card in the set ever made. Like, who doesn't want to look at Jace's pretty face that costs $30? Yeah. So, uh, let's open this. I'm so sorry. You can't see almost anything on here. Here. If you don't mind. Oh, well, look. It's Nisa. Yay. Um, <laughs> why I laughed when I got Nisa. Well, I don't know if I laughed or not. You can criticize me or not. But I got Nisa at the pre-release. So I went to pre-release with friends. Uh, Legacy Brothers Gaming, aka Razzle Kittens, either way it works, and I got Nisa, and so I'm like, oh, which fat pack am I gonna get? And I got Nisa out of a Chandra one. So basically this comes with, well, I'll show you, two cardboard things that don't matter at all. <laughs> Nine packs, so this is like five, yeah, five of the packs right here. Uh, to, uh, boost, well, I want to say booster box, why did I say booster, deck boxes, which later, if you were becoming a harder core gamer, was not very impressive, a bunch of land, and four more packs, so nine packs all together, and oh, I got a, oh, I like this one, actually, I think this, this came with the black one, if you can see it. It's got the nice emblem right there. So, I know what you guys want to see. You probably have already fast-forwarded through this. So, let's crack this one open. And open the four first, because we know how it is. You guys. Ugh. As you can see, the cur maybe Maybe this is a perfect uh, setting, unless you don't like messes. <laughs> Sorry. Well, let's get that right here. 20. So, this has been a while. How are you guys? I'm good. Okay, we, we, we weren't asking you. Okay. Oh, but I'm pumped. Pumped, pumped, pumped. Whew! So you could just go through, pause to see all these commons. I'm not really going to do it, sorry guys, because I'm lazy and uh, I know you guys want to get right to the good stuff. Send to sleep, good card, great card, and ooh, Thopters. Ooh! Not to co guy. And our first of our uncommons, uh,. Zendikar Incarnate. Pretty good. Uh, Flashback Marauder. That's actually really good, too. And another good card. And our card is... A Helm of Gods. Haven't seen this. It's pretty cheap equipment, but okay. And... And nothing special. <laughs> uh, it's gonna be dirty. Let's put that right there. Whoop! Way back there. Step in the next back. Ugh, I just really want to get something good. I am really excited. 
want to get something on gold. Oh, Chandra's Fury. Good. I'll, I'll try to read through some of these. Night Snare. Great card. I'm just going to read this right off the top. It's basically Thoughtseize. Well, you can pause right here and read it. But it's basically Thoughtseize, but you don't lose two life. But it's also very expensive. Uh, Timberwolf guy. Sorry that you can't see these commons. Sorry, guys. I'm, like, leaning over this camera. That's not fun. <laughs> uh, Valor of Akros. Oh, my goodness. This card. This card is amazing. It gives you a 2-2 uh, green elemental creature every time you pull a land. So that's definitely going into the deck. And... Oh, I'm, I'm getting rares that I don't even know. Dark Potention. Search your library for a card that... Put that card into your hand, then shuffle your library. Okay. It has Spell Mastery. Read... It's pretty good spell mastery. Okay, zombie land. I mean, sorry, forest. What am I doing? Is that big there? It's nothing good at all so far. Gosh, is this a bomb? I'll be. I'll feel. I'll feel so sad because this took five days to come. Ah, oh, and I. F psh. I wish this came faster. Shrouding mess. You can see. Oops. Ooh, this guy's good because he's a really big threat at pre-release. 2-3 with Death Touch and Renown. So, you don't want to be running into him. Oh, good uh, reprint. Nice reprint. Oh, this card. He was great at pre-release for me. Nice. Oh, here we go. So, Joe Arga in Invocation. Inferno guy. And... Oh, we have Mizian Melder, Mel, me, 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 Medler. Golly, what am I doing? I can't speak right now. Okay, so nothing good too far, but that's just ugh, three packs. All right, and it's still. I'm gonna have. Ugh, what's going on? I need to. Sorry, I'm leaning over actually a big camera. So, uh, there we are. That's all better. Liliana, do us some luck, okay, girl, girl. I'm serious, though. I'm serious. Oh, nice. Fetid. You know. Healing hands. In front. Scare, 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 you know, whatever. Another one. Nice. Trying to get this one uncommon, and you'll see it. Oh! Yay! I did! It's really good because whenever you draw a card, your target opponent just takes the top two cards of his or her library. Put it in the graveyard. If they're both non-land cards that share a color, repeat the process. So, mono deck murder, <laughs> if anything. Uh, oh, great card, too. And then... Okay. I don't know this card, either. They're all sorceries or artifacts. Okay. Tragic Arrogance. Uh, for each player you choose among the permanents that player controls, an artifact, a creature, an enchantment... And Planeswalker, then each player shuffles, s player sacri sacrifices all other non-land permanents he or she controls. Okay, that's interesting. I didn't quite get that. Probably went right through my head because I can't take that. No land, but we got this. It's good for people who do not have sleeves. Who are playing raw. My mess is getting bigger. Alright, let's crack into that next one. I'm hoping for a next toolage, if anything. And it fell! Golly, I'm sorry, guys. <gasps> sorry, I'm a failure. Just, shows to sh just goes to show how much I can't spend on a good camera. Well, I do have a good camera, except, boy, the storage is low. I'm trying to, like, get it to work. S shake it. You said do as well. Blow on it. You can blow on it, too, if you want. I, I, I don't think you will, but... Great if you did. I, I feel the I feel the wind blowing through the screen of this awesomeness. All right. Oh my gosh. I'm just gonna go through really quickly because I'm running soon out of time. Negate card. Lightning javelin. Great card. Mm. All right. Got right to the uncommon. So so here we go. 
Daniel's tomb. And oh, oh, this is good. This is good. Return all non-land permanents with converted mana cost of X or less to their owner's hands. Let's see. And we have a foil psychic rebuttal. Oh, I know psychic rebuttal. Target target instant or sorcery spell that target targets you. Okay, cool, nice. That's our foil of the day, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we only get uh, one foil per fat pack. Or stopter. Oh my gosh, sorry. I keep clipping it. I mean, I guess you can all guess what I'm using for a camera by now because it's pretty cheesy. Oh, nothing. I have no mythics. If this goes without mythics, I'm going to be so sad. <clears throat> so sad. Um, uh, you have a Swarth Mage, great card. Another one. Oh! Disperse is good. If we're gonna use Liliana's. Oh! We hit the uncommons. Okay. Cool story there. Throw that over there. Yeah, okay. One. Wait, what? Okay. Okay, you can do that. Scryfish. And. Uh, an Emberwad. A helio lion, you know. Oh, this kills me. This kills me. I'll read it to you. Trample. If another red source you control would deal damage to a permanent or player, it deals that much damage plus one to that permanent or player instead. Oh, this is tragic. I. Uh, four packs left, I think. And not a single, like. Mythic, you you see, like, I'm complaining. Well, here we have the player's guide if anybody needs to learn if they're buying a fat pack. Except you should probably get the deck builder's tool kit, or like a, I don't know. Ugh. Gosh. Leave a comment in the comment section below to see if I even make it that well. I'm just gonna, I'm just too frustrated already to the point where I just give it up. Other pile of cards. Mega Ring Network. This guy. <laughs> Thunderclap Raven and uh, Scry Five. Reveal the top five card, top card of your library. If it's a creature card, you draw f cards equal to the power of, y y and you gain life equal to that toughness. Okay. Pretty disappointing. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. No, I'm kidding. Um, I don't know. Probably just me. Probably went like, well, let's give this kid a crappy one. Because he does deserve it. Oh, two left. Two left and not even... <sighs> you just have no idea how mad I am. Like, how I waited for this for this long. And nothing. <laughs> uh, madness is dragging me to do this. Sorry, guys. I'm disappointed to the world. <sighs> Valor thing. Hydro Splash. Sentinel. And... Oh! Uh, if it couldn't get any worse. Uh, if it couldn't get any worse. I know it's not worse, guys, but I'm just saying I'm just disappointed because this is the crappiest fat pack I've ever opened. <sighs> Yes, and I said the C word. <laughs> this is going to go down terribly. Guess this is what I get. Bang. Act of treason. Okay. I give up yet again. I give up on life. I give up. Because it's not fair. How I can do anything. Alright, last pack. Leave a comment in the comment section below if you think I will do anything good at all. There's gonna be another enchantment source of everything. And. <sighs> Pretty decent, but not something to be uh, hooting and hollering about if you got no mythics at all in your fat pack. 
first strike when Knight of the White Orchard enters the battlefield. If an, an opponent controls more lands than you, you may search your library for a planes card, put it into your onto the battlefield, and then shuffle your library. And I only got a foil. Yeah, whatever. Alright, guys. That's my video. I hope you liked it. Probably didn't. Crappiest. Probably the crappiest episode I've ever done. But I hope you enjoyed the kind of part of it <laughs> that was to be enjoyable. But it was disappointing. I have to say that was a disappointment to myself in Magic. I was really hoping for a mythic. Last time I got two mythics, and so I'm like, why can't I get more? And I, I, the probably the most decent card that I got was another Sphinx's tutelage. Tutelage. All right, I'll see you guys off, and see you guys later on the other side.